Hey guys, it's Xiang, finally back for more Pokemon Leaf Green, and, um, I think it's been, it's been a really long time since I've recorded, um, so it's nice to be back, and I've just been super busy lately, um, but anyway, this is gonna be a pretty random video of, like, random stuff that we need to do before the Elite Four. First of all, we are going to teach double- we are going to get into battle with Onyx, apparently. Okay, so Pain, um, I did do some grinding since the last time I uploaded. So, um, I'm not sure what levels they were before, but my team has, uh, grown a bit in levels. So, um, here we go, Pain is level 45 now. So that is good, and, um, but yeah, we are going to teach um, one of our Pokemon Double Edge. In the last episode, at the end, I asked you guys, please let me know which Pokemon I should teach it to because I don't know anything about Pokemon and I need help. So, um, here's Double Edge, and like, at least five of you guys said teach Double Edge to, um, Edgeworth. So, that is what I'm gonna do. I guess that is a good idea. So, yeah. Um, Edgeworth is able to learn double edge and so is everybody else okay so i'm back i just want to check my last video to see how many of you guys um in the comments said uh, teach edgeworth um double edge and i think like seven or eight of you did and i think a couple of you may have said on skype as well to teach edgeworth double edge so thank you guys for suggesting that i think it's pretty um unanimous because nobody else said anybody else, so... Um, let's see. I think I'll get rid of Hydro Pump, because that's kind of pretty weak and, like, you know... Don't really use that at all. So, yeah, Edgeworth forgot how to use Hydro Pump, and Edgeworth learned Double Edge. So, thank you guys for, for telling me what to, um, teach Double Edge to, because that's really helpful, because... Like I said, I don't know anything, and here's another Onyx. Okay. So, Pain, um... Use Earthquake, I guess. So we can get on to, um... It's super effective, but it doesn't do that much. I guess they're the same level or something. Anyway, um... I think I... Kind of forgot what I was doing. Oh, but this is gonna be like a random video with random stuff. So that was the first thing that we had to do. And the next thing that we're gonna do is fly to, um, let me think here. We have a lot of places to go. Um, not Route 4. Cerulean, Saffron, um, I think, yeah, let's go to Saffron first, might as well. Go pick up something there that we need to do. Okay, um, we are back here in, um, Victory Road, and, uh, I'm just wondering, did I fool any of you? Because I really hope I did, but then, you know, I was just thinking about it, and I'm like, that was kind of stupid of me to do, because you probably are, all of you are probably, like, way smarter than I am. So, you probably just thought, oh, this dumb girl, she's just doing something weird, just fast forward, get on to whatever <laughs> we're going to be doing in this episode. But, all that aside, you guys are the best. Um... You put up with me, and, uh, yeah, you guys said to teach pain double edge. So, we are going to do that, and, um, yeah, in case you don't know, I'm using an emulator, which means I have save states, which means I could do something stupid like that, and, yeah. So, anyway, double edge, um... Let's see, it does 120 damage and its accuracy is 100%. Um, it has a little bit of recoil. But anyway, uh, I don't really know which one. I think I'm gonna get rid of Horn Attack. I think one of you said get rid of Horn Attack. So, um, that's what I'm going to do. Thank you guys, though, for, for all the help you've been. I mean, I just had so much help from you guys. It's, it's just been really good and really thankful because I, I've played Leaf Green and Fire Red before, but I guess it didn't really help because I still don't know what I'm doing. Um, but one thing I wanted to say that 
I don't know if I said this before, but I did some grinding. Did I mention that already? Well, I did some grinding since the last episode, and um, as you can see, their levels are higher. But anyway, I did also teach um, some new moves. So um, I think Earthquake and, and Thrash are new, and obviously Double Edge. Um, I taught Hydro Pump to Edgeworth, and um, what else is new here? I think Solar Beam. Sleep powder, maybe? I don't really remember. But anyway, here are their new moves. Um, focus punch might be new. Is that new or not? I I really don't remember. It's been too long since I've recorded, so I don't remember what I did. Oh, Dragon Claw and Fire Blast, I think, are both two new moves for Von Karma. And I don't think I taught anything new to Phoenix, because there's not really anything. So if you guys have any suggestions for teaching Phoenix a new move that would be helpful, or if you think these are good moves for him to have, then I guess I don't need to teach him anything new, but um, maybe if I remember, I'll show you what TMs I have. Actually, no, nah, I won't show you now. I'll just get out of here. Okay, there's a gold bat, and um, Pain almost took him out with one hit um, with double edge, so yeah. Um, Next, we are going to go to um, Saffron City, I think. Uh, yeah, so we are going to go pick up one Pokemon over here, which I think you guys know what I'm talking about because we didn't pick one when back in episode 20 or whatever it was that we had the opportunity to pick one of these Pokemon. And um, let's see. This is a Hitmonchan, and this one's a Hitmonlee. And I am actually gonna go for the Hitmonchan. So, um, I am not using it for anything. I mean, I'm not gonna be using it on my team, but um, I do need like 60 Pokemon for to get into the post game. So that's what I'm doing. I think we should have, um, like we've owned 60 Pokemon, so I'm not sure. I think that is enough um, to get into the post game. I hope so, because in the last, um, I spent a quite a bit of time just catching a random Pokemon that I didn't have already. And, um, you know, since the last episode. So, um, let's see. We are going to go to, um, uh, I think it, I think this is where we're going next. <laughs> okay, so, um, up this way, if we go into the water, Edgeworth, you surf please. Um, hopefully we don't see too many, um, Pokemon, actually. We hadn't, that was pretty good. Usually I see like two, uh, Pokemon and I forgot to heal. I think we're gonna be okay. So here is a trainer. Now you come, uh, oh wow, you come all the way here. I cannot read. Maybe you're a Pokemon act too. I'm not, but I will see your collection if you beat me. But if I beat you, then you have to leave me alone. So he has a Rhyhorn level 29. I I hope Pain can do this. Um, let's try Earthquake. Okay, good, super effective. I really don't know if it's super, like, I didn't know it was super effective. Um, look at Tongue. No, I'm not switching Pokemon. I'm just gonna use, um, Pain for now. All right, so another Earthquake should take this one out. E no. Okay, well. Okay, he's done. Um, I should have healed before I came. I forgot about that. But anyway, here is a new place, the power plant. Um, I guess it's, it's an optional area, that's why I never came before, and I never actually went to this before when I played the game before. But um, there will be wild encounters, and we'll be picking up items, and I will be cutting out the random encounters, because I... Wait, have we seen Voltorb in the wild? I think we have, I did catch one, so... I don't remember if um, this was... Did I catch it on screen or not? 
Oh, I must have caught it between um, the last episode and now. And here's a Magnemite. Um, I also caught one, as you can see, by the um, the little Pokeball thing there. Um, but I don't think you've seen it on screen as a wild encounter. So, but um, I am actually going to use um, repels. Oh, and one thing. Um, since we're here, rare candies. I have 12 of them, and um, I had seven of them before. But yesterday, one of my friends, um, Cameron, helped me get five more rare candies. And I really want to thank him for that, because that is going to be really helpful, because that means I don't have to grind so much before Elite Four. So yeah, um, shout out to him. He is doing a Fire Red Let's Play, and um, I will put his link in the description below, so you can check him out. And yeah, um, I don't really remember if I'm supposed to go up or down. But, um, I think this is the right way. What was that? Oh, it's a volt electrode. Oh, cool. Um, level 34. I try double edge. Okay, cool. Um, I think I'm going to switch paint out, though, because, yeah. He's obviously getting low there. I should have. <sighs> healed him up, but I didn't. So, D. Vasquez, it's your turn to be at the front. Alright, so, there should be some items. I think I'm going the wrong way. Repel wore off. I need so much more. Okay, so, I might, like, just speed up this whole thing, because I might get lost, even though it seems silly that I get lost, but you guys know me pretty well, maybe, that I just, I'll get lost, even if I've been here, like, Ten times, I still get lost. There's TM17. Oh, and I think we're going to be picking up quite a few TMs in here. So, um, if one of them, if you think I should teach my Pokemon one of them, you go ahead and tell me in the comments or message me or whatever. Um, because I need all the help I can get. And we have two, that's Max either. I meant Super Repel. We have three of them. So hopefully that'll help us get through here. And like I said, if this gets to be super boring, I am just going to speed it all up. Or we could just talk about something, I guess. What do you want to talk about? Like, E3? <laughs> I was actually gone when E3 happened, which kind of sucked because I was looking forward to it and then like my family decided to go on a trip for a week and that was E3 week, so yeah. But oh well, Thunderstone, we don't need this one, but um... Like I mentioned in one of the last episodes that there was a Thunderstone we could get and for free and I ended up buying one in the Pokemart because or in the Celadon um, department store because I was too lazy to go and get this one for free. Um, I'm gonna try Psybeam. I have no idea. If this doesn't work out so well, I will... Um, it's actually super effective against me but it doesn't do anything. So, good for us. Um, another side beam, I guess. Um, so anyway, what was I saying? I don't remember. So, we'll just move on. Repel war off. I think we need one more repel, and then we'll get to what we're getting to. Which, you guys probably already know what I'm trying to get to, but... Oh well, I'm not gonna say. Um, let's see, nothing down there. There's probably a bunch of hidden items in here, but I just don't know where they are, so... Um, there! <laughs> Zapdos is right there, and kind of close, isn't it? Because it's like poking into my head, which shouldn't be comfortable. I wouldn't... I wouldn't think it would be comfortable, but hi. Zapdos, um, this is the first time I've fought Zapdos, I think, or not, I don't remember. <laughs> um, and, uh... Yeah, we'll see how it goes. I was going to catch the Zapdos, but I think I'm just gonna, um, I'm not going to catch it, so at least I don't plan to. I guess I might change my mind eventually, but don't protect yourself. I don't know, um, how this is gonna be, it's not. Ugh, sorry, D. Vasquez. I should have known better than to put a bug out for a bird Pokemon to peck. 
Sorry about that. Okay, so, um, Edgeworth won't be good. Gumshoe, Von Karma, Phoenix. I'm just gonna send out Von Karma, because hopefully this is gonna be okay. I hope. Um, Flamethrower, please do a lot. Okay, and I got burned. Great. And it paralyzed me, but it should be okay, because if it just, like, it protected itself, thanks. But, um, since it's burned, it should die soon-ish in one more hit, even if I don't do anything. Agility is not going to help you much at this point. Sorry, Zapdos. And I'm paralyzed. Okay, so burn, please do your thing. And we are done. I probably could have caught it, actually, but... Oh, well. I didn't catch it, so there we go. And it just disappears. I don't know, where, where did it go? Because, like... I don't think you can see it ever again in this game. Um, but yeah, I wonder where it went. But uh, we are going to fly back somewhere. So let me just check my notes here and uh, figure out where we're going next. So I'll be right back.